might be like up there or something. Alright, let's do this. Hello, Daniel. So this is it. You've decided to face the Pokemon League. The final test you must pass b to become a champion is held here in this building. I wish you the best of luck from the bottom of my heart, Daniel. I look forward to meeting you again soon. Alright, where is this? Oh, there he is. Oh, my son asked me earlier, how many Gimme Ghoul coins I had. I have 385. So I will fix that. But not today, probably. Maybe. Are you ready to face the Pokemon League's champion assessment? Uh, yeah, but I'd like Victory Road first, if that's at all possible. Let's see here. Daniel Narha, Narenha Academy, is it? It appears you have a total of eight gym badges. Very well. You may proceed to the interview room. The interview room? Thank you for coming today. Please do have a seat. I, Rika, will be your interviewer. Let's get started with the first portion of the champion assessment. We begin with the interview. First thing first, let me see how many badges you have. Excellent, you have all eight. Next, I'd like to ask you a few questions, if you wouldn't mind, Daniel. Please think carefully, as you as you may automatically fail the interview, depending on your answers. Let's begin. How did you get here today? I mean, I rode on my foot, but I mostly walked, right? I walked? Very good, very good. Please tell me the name of the school you were enrolled in. Ah, that's right. So what brings you to the Pokemon League today? Just for fun, I guess. Yes, indeed. Why else would you be here, I suppose? Now, what do you intend to do if you become a champion? to be even stronger. I see. Interesting. Tell me. Which of the eight gyms gave you the most difficulty? Um. Which of the eight gyms did give me the most difficulty? And let me think about what the fuck. Um, Glissado Gym wasn't that bad. Montanavera. Alfornada, I think. I see. Now, what was the name of the gym leader you faced there? Fuck, man. I'm looking this shit up because I'm not answering... Wrong. The fuck is this? I don't need to look it up on my phone, though. Alfonada. Yep. 
I did okay tulip I'm <laughs> glad you seem to remember yeah <laughs> it does seem that way but do you remember which type of Pokemon tulip used it was psychic right I'm not I'm not gonna not Um, not a psychic type. Wonderful. Building the skills needed for the champion assessment is no small feat. You must have met a lot of Pokemon to get here, Daniel. Category of the Pokemon you chose to be your first partner. Very good, very good. Now, please forgive me, but I'm going to repeat a previous question. Remind me, what do you tend to do if you. if and when you become a champion? I'm gonna become stronger. Ah, oh, yes, that's right. Next is the final question of the interview. Do you... I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, I Good job, kiddo. That about wraps up the interview. And let me be the first to congratulate you, Daniel. You just passed the first part of the champion assessment. Why, of course. On your first try, too, no less. Don't think anyone's done that since Nimona. But anyway, time to switch gears and get ready for the next segment. Second segment is what we call the Elite Test. And you'll be facing the Elite Four in Pokemon battles. Guess that's pretty obvious from the name of the test, huh? Anyway, we're the best the league has to offer. You'll be facing us four in a row, no turning back. This won't be a cakewalk, I promise you that. Make sure you're all ready and then go into the room behind me. I came in ready. There's no victory road though, which bums me out. If this room is not themed, it does not look themed. I love his. I love. Everything about him, the way he looks. He looks awesome. Now then, let's get started, eh? Let good old Rika be the first of the Elite Four to take you on. I'd say I'll go easy on you, but I'd be lying. Think fast. Whisk Cash. No clue. I know I need to switch. I finally get to battle you. I've been looking forward to this, so don't give up too soon. Oh no, I'm not giving up shit. What do I do though? I think. So that. So do I think ground or water? So if a ground type moves come in Bombardier, if a water type moves come in, then Backscalibur. These are my options. Let's go Bombardier. 
So I think he's got an EQ coming our way. Watch, it'll be an amnesia. Earth power! Yes. Not an EQ. But... Blizzard, that... That is excellent. Right, so we're gonna get another knockoff in, and then we're gonna let... We can't... We're, we can't switch into a Blizzard with anyone. Alright, so what are we gonna do? Avoid the attack! <laughs> uh, this isn't gonna take it out, but... No fucking way? Alright, this will take it out. Way to go, Bombardier! Dawn fan? Alright, so he's ground type. Alright, let's switch. Could've went Palafin. Might've been a better choice. I'm gonna do it Palafin. And then into... Uh, Backscalibur. But... That hurts my feelings. back Excalibur but what we can do is go since it is ground type Skeletor game and Palmot are not gonna see they're not gonna see say what we're gonna let's just go bombardier again see what they've got for us because I don't think it showed did it maybe it'll show now it does show now yeah we'll switch to palafin that's such a good move <laughs> that's such a good move the strats ladies and gentlemen the strats Zero to hero, just like that. Oh, uh, we're gonna go waterfall. Actually, we're gonna trust. We're gonna go waterfall. And we need, after this match, we're gonna... We're gonna take the focus sash back. Uh, camera up? Absolutely not. I have... I... I... I love this character. I love this character. Because one, he's a ground type user. I love ground types. Ground type is my favorite type. Flygon, Nidal King, Sand Slash, Cubone. Quads are. Make this. Make me do this to my boy. Ha <laughs> Impressive. You're really something else, kiddo. You're gonna make me do this to my boy. Alright. Not happy about it. 
Let's finish this. Go on, Clodsire. Shake things up a bit. You're not gonna go first, my guy. I am well aware of what a Clodsire looks like. No need for ceremony. Oh, fuck you, man. I know so much about Clodsire. Uh, uh, uh. Idiot. Idiot. Alright, can this sandstorm fade already? my patience but let's just just trying to calm down watch your step because things are about to get shaky Finally subsided. So he's got toxic, protect, earthquake. And he's straight ground right now. Let's do Clodsire v Clodsire. Like I said, you're straight ground right now. I didn't think that should have killed, but a crit makes sense. Alright, so now what the fuck are we gonna do? We are going to see what, um, it's gonna protect this turn. Oh, nope, he's not. He's gonna use liquidation. Oh, that's not so bad. Oh, dodging. We're dodging out here. Might not. Oh, it does. It wraps it up. Hell yeah. Not bad, kiddo.